Hello and welcome back for some more Super Mario RPG. Today we are going to be heading down further into Land's End and hopefully defeat a certain boss before this video ends. So if these things could just please move out of the way. Well at least just one of them. Okay. Yeah. No! Oh man, I could have got that. Alright. We're gonna have to fight these things. So let's start with Shocker and let's kill this Criffid over here. Eat that! Alright, 95 damage, not bad. Oh god. Well, at least you're attacking Peach. Peach is not gonna fall asleep. Those, uh, Gek... Gek... Gekids? Is that what they're called? Gek... Gek something. It was Gek something. <clears throat> um, those things in the middle, they get confused for some reason, I'm not sure why. But yeah, they'll help you out a little bit. So we're just gonna save those guys for last. And why did you poison me? Why? Oh my god. Um, actually, no, why would I do something like that? Instead, I should just attack you since Mario has some great attack power. Oh god, what are you doing? What are you doing to me? Ouch! Oh man, that hurt. That hurt a lot, sir. I'm probably gonna have to use Psychopath on that thing so I can figure out how much health it has, because I know it's a strong ass monster. Let's heal Mario. Here, status ailments. Oh god, I can't get the timing right for that thing, ever. But, at least I'm doing some damage to this guy. I might have to do a lot more. Oh god, what are you doing? Ow! 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 That hurt. That hurt. Um, yeah, so let's do that. He has 122 damage. Aloe there. <laughs> that was pretty funny. A little bit funny. It wasn't funny at all. That was stupid. God. Anyway. And why would you poison Mallow? Why? Why would you do these things? Have you no shame? Alright, so I can get rid of him in a few turns. And you're gonna use Gunk Ball on Mallow? No, that's probably gonna kill him, isn't it? Yep, it just killed him. <laughs> yeah, I know, you're confused. Just attack them. Alright. I can pretty much demonstrate this. Like, oh man. This uses two, That these two use four, and this uses two? You're kidding me. I can revive someone with only two FP. That, that is just incredible. Yeah, full health at that. Oh no, crap. Haha, you tried to attack Peach. Luckily I've got that uh, one pin on her. Will you please die soon? Just, just soon? Doesn't have to be right now, but soon? Okay. Ooh. Ah, nice! I got that timing. Good stuff. Alright. How much did he have? Like, 122 last time I checked? Yeah, that's not gonna- Oh my god, that did so much. You're confused. Just kill yourself. You should heal yourself here, Peach. Or Toadstool. She's Toadstool in this game. I keep. Ugh. There we go. Now you're dead. And I got my defense up. What now? I'm just gonna hit you a shocker. Hopefully that destroys you in one shot. Urgh. Oh yeah, it did a lot of damage, but it didn't kill you in one shot. And maybe one of these things can get confused and sort of hurt each other quick enough so that they die, and I don't have to deal with them. Maybe. Just maybe. I guess not. Oh, oh, well, we got a chance. Alright. Nope, you're not dead yet. Okay, well that's fine. I can take you out much faster. I think you took the most damage out of all of them, sir. Okay. That took about five minutes, but... We can do this now! Yeah! Kill! Kill them all! Level up! Kill them all! Yes! Kill! 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 Aww. 
Alright, so Mario reached level 13. Let's increase his power. And Mallow, Mallow, Mallow reached level 13. Let's increase his, his special and stuff. And I'm going to increase Juno's power. Good stuff, good stuff. Alright, so there's this guy hiding back here. He will sell you another star so you can mow these guys down really quickly for, I believe, 500 coins. So we're just going to check what we have here. We have just about enough. Trust me, it's worth it. So you're looking for a star? I'll sell you one for 400 coins. Okay, it's only 400. Are you interested? Yes. That's even better. Alright, now, he's gonna go away. I believe you can come back here, like, after you leave the area, and then buy it again, and, like, sort of grind that way. I think. I'll, I'll have to check that out later. But, position yourself. And... GO! KILL THEM ALL! DEATH! TO ALL OF THEM! I miss one. Ah! Kill! Yes, level up! Kill! Holy crap, I got a lot of levels up. Levels up? No, level ups. Okay. Toadstool reached level 14, which is really good, so let's increase her health, because she needs it badly. And let's increase Bowser's power, like always. Alright, so... Okay, good. Whew! Alright, so now we're in Belome Temple. <sighs> Below, we're, we're gonna see him again. For 100 coins, a shortcut will take you back to the surface. No thanks, why would I want to do that? Hell no. Get out of my face, sir. Kill yourself. Okay. You want us your fortune told? It'll cost 50 coins. <sighs> Fine. See the three faces on the wall? Hit them in any order and you'll receive your fortune. Alright. So let's get that. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That was, that was 50 coins right there. That was awesome. So yeah, they're just really trying to take our coins away from us in this in this place. This place looks like it's made out of gold, but yeah. Depending on which order you hit these, you get a different fortune. I think the best one, which is 100 coins and a frog coin, I think, is 2, 3, and 1. 23 is number 1. Ha 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 ha. Except that game came out years later. Um, yep, I know. And moving on, going down the pipe. And oh, shy away, destroy. Oh my god, what is that thing? Looks like a variation of that other guy with the inappropriate move. This is a rib a ribite? What? I'm gonna kill the shy away since they're weak. Oh my god, that hurt. That, like, that looked like it hurt. Okay. Oh, nice, Peach. Nice. Venom drool. Oh, God. See? It's the same inappropriate move. It's very frightening. And we can just take you out with this. Goodbye, sir. And now, what should I do? I shall attack you. Holy crap, I guess they're not that strong. Well, the other ones were green, right? Were they? Oh man, I'll have to go back in one of my videos and check that out. I believe, I'm pretty sure they were green. But uh, yeah, I got 68 coins out of that, holy crap. Anyway, so we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Oh, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15? Good god, that was a lot. Alright, that was like a, that was 150 coins, I think, maybe, I'm not sure. Um, and a frog coin, nice. Moving on. The yellow tile will get you to the next room. Your fortune determines which room you'll arrive at. If you're lucky, you'll run into Belome and Monstro Town will be just beyond him. Okay. How you know this? Sorry, I'm not accepting visitors past my bedtime. Yeah, if you, um, when you, like, punch his tongue back in, and the fortune comes out, you'll get a different message. Um, during certain times. Well, you, you might get the same message over and over again, but I highly doubt that. So when you get that message that I just got, you'll get this, and give me the key and I'll let you pass through. Uh -huh. So, uh, yeah, once we get a certain key later in the game, we're gonna be able to grab all of this beautiful deliciousness. So let's go back up for now. Let's try and get a different fortune. Sorry. Ugh, come on. So yeah, you're gonna have to leave the room and come back. Sorry, come, uh, come on, how often does that happen? Are you serious? 
I want a different message. Are you freaking serious? Dude! Just give me what I want! Give me what I want! I want to get the message saying, are you serious? Maybe if I go down there and then back up. That is retarded. Just give me a different message, man. I know, I don't have the key, so I can't do anything over here. This, that makes this place completely useless. So why don't you just let me through the other way? <laughs> I'm so hungry. Wish I had something to eat. Come on, jeez, man. How many times did I try that? Like, ten times? So anyway, that's the message you want to have. So you can come over here. Go down the pipe. Go down the pipe. And fight Beloom. So yeah, we're fighting him yet again. But this time he um sort of lets us have a a moment to equip ourselves with some true form pins. And that's mutant poison attacks. I want the wake up pin actually. There we go. And I'm lagging over here. I apologize, but I'm lagging. Anyway, so I got true form pins on Mario and Mallow and a wake up pin on Toadstool. Make sure you have a wake up pin on Toadstool, so uh, you'll you'll see in a bit. Mm, you look so tasty. I think I'll just have a a snack. You. <laughs> All right. So now let's destroy this guy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, actually, we are we weren't fully healed. I should, could have just used a group hug right there. Oh well. I actually have to keep track of my FP. Oh my god, I only have five. That is not good. So why don't we just take some time out of our out of our day and give ourselves 40 more. I never forget a taste. In fact, I can clone someone after just one slurp. Watch. You all look so delicious, but how do you taste? Yum, yum. No! Ah, sour! Ugh. There we are. <laughs> yeah, and he sort of poops out another Mario. So now we've got a Mario to fight. That's not very good. Um, I don't think they're exact clones. Like, they don't have the same sort of... They're not the same level and have the same attack power and all that. So, in fact, I think they have less health. Well, let me let me check that out. I know he has like over eight, 800. Well, let me use Psychopath on you and figure out your health. And yeah, only 167. And he doesn't say anything. So Aurora Flash. I don't think that does anything. Nope. Okay. Well, that that puts them to sleep. Luckily, we had the wake up pin on Toadstool. That way, everyone's not asleep. And then I could just use her to um, heal everybody and wake them back up. Um, you don't really have to attack that Mario, but I, I just, um, I just wanted to show. I mean, he has a different thing when he, he has a different thing to say when he eats different people. I think when he eats up Toadstool, he says, uh, he says that uh, she tastes just like peaches. There we are. So there goes another Mario. Hurt you? Yeah. You don't scare me one bit, fake Mario. You're nothing against the real Mario. I'm just gonna use Shocker. Do some damage on Belome. I should really just put all my concentration on Belome, but he's he's not all that threatening since I have a wake up pin. That's his like that's basically his most dangerous attack. Only if like one person didn't have a wake-up pin. So make sure you have at least one wake-up pin when you're here. It'd be nice to have three of them. Uh, no, what's the point of that? <laughs> I swear, I'm just like desperate to use super moves. Um, I have 16 of those things left. And I'm really lagging here, what's going on? Got a freebie also, awesome. gonna leave that Mario there. He's not bothering anybody. Yeah. Alright. We're doing 
doing about 100 damage each turn. That's not... That's not bad at all. Oh, come on. Quit eating Mario. Eat somebody else and show, them else, show the viewers some dialogue here. We all know Mario is sour. Great. Okay. Pilon should be going down pretty soon. He's not a hard boss at all. So let's take him out. Okay. <laughs> Mallow's not doing much damage that way. Good lord, man. And this, ju this just goes to show how broken Peach is. Toadstool, I mean, crap. But yeah, Toadstool is pretty... She's a pretty broken character. She just makes everything so easy. It's unbelievable. Go ahead, keep using Light Beam. I'm just gonna use Peach to, you know, sort of cheat my way out of it. If you wanna get... If you wanna make the game really harder, you, you just don't use Peach at all. In fact, I don't even think I've ever seen a playthrough where someone neglected to use Peach. I'm sure there is one out there. Someone had to have come up with that idea before I did. So, yeah. All I know is I'm not going to be the one to do that. I'm going to keep using Toadstool throughout the, the entire game. Much got the timing down for the Marios. Yeah. Eat Mallow or something. Tell him how he tastes like, uh. I'm not sure what he says when he eats Mallow. Hmm. All I really know is Mario and Peach. In fact, I should have had Bowser here. Maybe he could have eaten him and said something funny. Oh, no, not again. I'm starving. Time to go home for dinner. Goodbye, boys and girls. See you next time. So instead of, you know, going home for dinner, he sort of just explodes and leaves coins behind. So now all we have to do is destroy the two Marios that have been walking in place this entire battle. And ouch. Let's destroy them with everything we have. Since I'm not going to run into another battle here, I'm pretty much just going to use all my FP. So might as well kill them with Shocker. Yeah. Die, please. Thank you. One more to go. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm out of FP already. That's alright. We can destroy him with physical attacks alone. Should be dead in a few turns. Actually, pretty soon. Like maybe this next. Yeah. This should definitely kill him. No, really? Don't we only have like a little over 150? Maybe I'm counting wrong. <laughs> well, it's not like I'm actually adding this up as time goes on. There we go. And that's the end of the battle. Good stuff. Okay. Yeah. Water's not gonna come gushing out of there, is it? Is it? Alright. Oh, hello again. That pipe is a shortcut to my home, Monstro Town. I'll see you there. Okay. Getting out. And now, we are in Monstro Town, our destination. Welcome to Monstro Town. Okay. I'm wondering if I should just... Well, let me check every house first. Uh, what are you doing? Breeze? Okay. Gust? Blast? Oh, he's angry. Okay. He doesn't blow you away, though. Monster Mama. Oh my, a traveler from afar? Welcome to Monstro Town, where many of our kind mingle. I'm a landlady, Monster Mama. A star, you say? Oh, you're here to see our star. She's upstairs, so feel free to go and take a look for yourself. What are you talking about? We want we want an object, not a not a person. 
I've been all around the world, but the strangest person I met is this old geezer in Rosetown. It really is weird, but definitely worth meeting. Sometimes if you jump at the right places, a treasure box will pop up out of thin air. Anything like this happen to you? These treasure boxes are known as surprise boxes, but they come <clears throat> because they appear out of nowhere. You think you found them all? But there are still 30 left. So this guy pretty much keeps track of how many how many uh, surprise boxes you've got. My guess is that there, there's one up here, no? I'm not really sure where all the surprise boxes are. They're not really important. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna... Okay. <laughs> Moving on! So, what do you think? Isn't our star adorable? She's so talented too. Folks come to see her from afar. No, I want a real star. A, a star star. Star bees? Oh, star piece! Nope, not familiar with him. So you came all the way out here to search for a star piece. He must really be important. This is the last place on land if you can't find it here. The only place left is up. Up? I saw that movie. So, you want to go there? Ha, <laughs> you're an open book. Okay, here's what you need to do. There's a secret passage to the sky yet. Bean Valley! You know, like Super... <clears throat> uh, Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, Bean Valley. But first, you must scale the cliff beyond the desert to get there. Since you're such a nice guy, I'll introduce you to someone that can help you. Sky Troopers! I need you! I'm not sure if this is a lady or a man. So I sort of just, like, switch between voices. And there they are. What was our flying time, troops? Uh, 8.52 seconds, Sergeant. Sky Troopers reported for duty. Ma'am! We're .52 seconds late. I hold myself personally accountable for the delay, ma'am. Still as rigid as ever about your rules and regulations. No need to bother with the protocol around me, Sergeant. I've got a favor to ask you, so we know it's a girl now. Yes, ma'am! Anything we can do for a civilian? This fellow here really wants to go to Bean Valley. Could you help him scale the cliff? Understood, ma'am. Get mustache over the cliff. We will succeed. We will now deploy ourselves to the cliff at land's end. Troopers, keep in tight formation. Hi. We have left off now. They're odd, but trustworthy. Good luck with your search. Yes, and good luck to you. Whatever it is you're doing. Oh yeah, this is... Still, the super jump is your specialty, right? Those multiple jumps of yours are pretty amazing. I heard that your record for a consecutive jump stand at 12. How do you do it? Jump more than 30 times in a row and I'll give you a prize. I'm not even sure if I can do that. I'll try my best to do that, but if I, if I don't during this playthrough, then I, then I just won't. <laughs> it's really weird. Sometimes I hear the guy next door. He's always mumbling about that crystal this and an evil that. Isn't a crystal some kind of shiny rock or something? I know, I've seen those somewhere. Yeah, so the guy he's talking about is a certain uh, character. <laughs> a character? God. A character that we're going to be meeting pretty not very soon, but one of these days. Ah, uh, You there! Rumor has it that you're quite an accomplished jumper! Oh, oh okay. Ah, uh, I may be out-jumped, but you're totally out-pumped! Yeah, I can see that. Anyway, so what you want to do is, you see that? See this key over here? Make him... Just make him ground pound or whatever. The strong silent type, eh? Yeah, I know. And that key will come closer and closer to the edge. So what you want to do is make them jump a few times. Don't you dig these vibes? Don't you dig these vibes? Don't you dig these vibes? Okay. So anyway, that... that what? That's not done yet? Good God. Do you not dig these vibes? Okay, it should be off now. Thank you. If you like... If you make him, like, keep jumping, then it'll eventually fall off the edge and you'll never have the key ever again. So we got the temple key. What we want to do is go back up to where Belom was. Yeah, so it's that key that I needed before. I'm just gonna do that. Now, hopefully... Oh, please. Come on. Alright, good. 
so now we're going back down there and we're gonna collect our goodies that key you have there looks pretty tasty yeah give him the key yep okay he's gone so now we get <clears throat> one two three four five six seven seven frog coins and I keep missing that <laughs> found a max mushroom that is good found a royal syrup that is good oh come on all right get rid of these stupid mushrooms found a firebomb that is also good three great items especially the firebomb that's an attack thing so now we got five flowers no wait four flowers <laughs> I can count and now let's go home well not go home but go to monstro town surprisingly there is no secrets at Mario's home well, we will have to go back there just for one tiny little thing. Oh, oh, collect, get that. Whew, good, I got it. All right, so as you can see, there's nothing here, but he, he's there, so formless. Yeah, we can't attack him for some reason. What you want to do is hit him with a special attack, and he will appear. Okay, um, he's completely immune to special attacks, so you're going to have to hit him with um, just regular attacks. Oh, wait, I didn't have to do that. Crap. So this this won't take very long. I'm just gonna do that. And I think he gives you, like, a whole bunch of coins. He's gotta give you something. Good lord, that was a lot of damage. He's not hard at all, to be honest. It's just that one move can hurt you if you're not prepared for it. So be wary of that. And the static E, I don't think that hurts at all. Okay, it hurts a little bit. It hurts a little bit. I should have healed. Whoops. But Peach can do some damage. I, I take back what I said when I when I said that she's completely useless when it comes to um Oh crap. Okay, that's just a one character hit. When I said uh that she was completely useless for attacking, she's actually she's alright. Uh, let's demonstrate the comeback move. I don't think I showed this yet. I might have. I'm not sure. But, yeah. The timing is right when the star hits the player. And now Mario's back to life. And I should really heal before he uses that move again. Oh. Ouch. Oh god, that might kill her. Okay, she's fine. You should be dying any second now, sir. Actually, I might as well use Psychopath. That technically is a special move, but it, you can still check things out. Okay, he's got 87. Mwahwahwah! Now, please die. Okay, one more hit, and you're done. Goodbye, sir. It's over. Oh, 30 experience. That's... That was... What? That's it? That was dis that was stupid. Absolutely nothing for that battle. Whatever. Anyway. So that's about it. So I guess I'm going to be cutting this off. Rate and subscribe if you haven't already. Well, actually, wait. You don't really rate videos anymore, like the five-star thing. You just like or dislike it now, but does that count as rating? I guess so. Well, like and subscribe if you haven't already. I will see you guys later.